Hello, I'm Clammerhead, Sandbar Oyster Company, Vice President, Co-Founder, my business partner, Dr. Nils Lindquist, is in the audience also. What I'm here to talk to you about today is a tuft. It's an oyster shell substitute. It's made from jute erosion control cloth that has been embedded with Portland cement. The idea of the tuft is to gather a lot of oysters in a small area and to be able to remove them from the tufts or to leave them depending on your purpose. If you look to the center of the screen, uh, okay, every corner, this is pretty much a picture of what I have in my hand. If you look to the left of that, on the far left of the screen, that is a string of tufts. The rack down below those three pictures in the bottom, that is 120 tufts at 100 oysters a piece. Do the math, or yeah, so do the math, it's like 120,000. If you look on the right, you see what a pile of seeded up tufts look like when they're dumped on a culling tray. And in the top right corner, that's my hand and one seeded tuft. How are we going here? Okay, yeah, there we go. Okay, uh, the idea behind these tufts is it's an ephemeral material. It can be made very tough or very delicate. We make these delicate so that you can wring them apart and the oysters come off pretty easy. Not all of the oysters come off real easy. We usually get about 75%, so you figure 75 oysters per tuft plus. Sometimes it's a little bit better. Those that are wrung off, they can go either wild cast on bottom for growing or they can be put in Vexor bags to float out and to grow out of singles for your boutique market. The ones that don't fall off the string, they can be wild cast on the bottom for wild harvest for cluster sales, for restoration, or some of that sort. Or they can be put right back inside of the Vexar bags like the oysters that did come off, and the string will go away on its own, so you still end up with pure oysters. And I think I went through that quicker than I was supposed to. Oh, the top right picture, that's the one I'm proud of. That is what tufts look like when you don't wring the oysters off of them. You just wild cast them on the bottom, and you let them grow. That pile is in combination with some of the strings that did come off but didn't totally shed. We just throw them on the bottom, we let them grow out in the appropriate areas. Okay, I think that's got me now. Thank you, Clement. I appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, throw up the shirt. <laughs>